This is Penny Keener, Stampin' Up! Independent Demonstrator and the original Keener Inker. Today we're going to be making a butterfly celebration card. For that, we are going to be using the Butterfly Brilliant stamp set. This is actually one set um, or one stamp. We're going to be using Mini Messages, which is also one stamp. The Brilliant Wings dies you can see lots of options and remember i said there was uh, the one stamp this cuts out all of that stamp in one crank and then also the message dies for the wording <clears throat> and then the meadow moments embossing folders there's two of them and i'm using the one that has the butterflies on it we're going to be using for uh, cardstock color basic white bumblebee and soft sea foam and then our beautiful Butterfly Bayou 6x6 Designer Series paper. Just absolutely gorgeous, great colors are involved. Um, and then for uh, ink, we're going to be using Tuxedo Black. And for sizes, um, we have some of that um, Bayou paper cut down. And this is one and a half by four. Um, a piece of the basic white, which is three and three quarters by five, and then our base cardstock, which is five and a half by eight and a half, scored at four and a quarter. So to get started, we're just going to fold this in half. It's pre uh, scored, and I'm going to use my bone folder to get a nice crease. With that basic white, what I've done is ran it through the embossing folder, and you can see that texture on there. I love being able to add um, some texture onto um, cardstock for a project. Just adds another layer of element to it. And I'm going to put this on. This one, normally I do my cardstock a quarter inch smaller so that I have an eighth of an inch border, but this is actually a half inch smaller, so it has a quarter inch border, so just a little more than normal. Um, on my uh, designer series paper, I am going to <clears throat> um, put adhesive around that. And then what I've already done is I've already die cut two butterflies, and this is in our um, bumblebee uh, color. And you can see how detailed it is. Uh, if I was going to just put this onto a card, I could use my fine tip glue pen, but my preference for something like this would be to actually use our adhesive sheets. But I'm going to have my butterflies a little bit looser. So what I'm going to do is remember there's a stamp and seal on the back side of this. I'm just going to attach it to this. And then this part will be loose on the card. So I'm going to do that on both ends. Just like that. And put it in the center of my card. So it kind of gives it almost more of a 3D effect. And it doesn't look as straight as I would like it. So I'm going to reposition it. With that stamp and seal, you do have the option to kind of do that if you're very gentle about pulling the stamp and seal plus um, you do not have the option because it sticks really well so I have my wording here um, I've already stamped and die cut it out um, and this says I'm so happy to celebrate these moments with you um, great for like a graduation a wedding um, baby uh, you name it lots of opportunities to use this card and then um, let me show you the butterfly here um, I am looking for, here we go. This is that uh, part of that um, designer series paper where it's just butterflies. I mentioned that the die cuts out the stamps, but it also happens to perfectly cut out the butterflies on this designer series paper. So great way to get good design and be able to use the majority of the paper. So I've already done that. I've cut out uh, this one here and I have... Uh, dimensionals on the back of it. I have two small ones underneath the bottom and then two regular size ones on the top. And so I'm going to put that butterfly right here in the center, a nice big um, butterfly. And you can see um, because there's multiple butterflies on that sheet, um, you can get different looks um, on it uh, with just that one sheet of de designer series paper. Uh, so here is the butterfly celebration card. Um, so uh, why did the kid throw the stick of butter out the window? <laughs> he wanted to see a butterfly. Please check out my website and subscribe to my channel for quick videos on how you can be a keener inker too.